welcome back now what we need to do is that we need to scroll automatically because if you type something here if you say for example do you have a car and send it's not gonna scroll automatically you have to scroll manually to see the last message so how can you fix this problem to fix this problem you can simply open the uh, the main.js and then in the main.js in the in three functions we need to add a code in the chatbot response we need to add this code chatbot uh, chat container dot scroll top is equal to chat uh, container dot scroll height similarly in the send message we need to add the same code at the end here we need to say chat container dot scroll top is equal to chat container scroll height scroll scroll height also in the server response we need to say chat container scroll top chat container scroll height now if I refresh and uh, test let me show you what's gonna happen so if I test now and if I say for example do you have a car and send it's gonna display it but we need to add so many messages so that we will have here the scroll uh, effect so I'm gonna say hi uh, do you have kids Um, uh, do you like pizza? Uh, let me try another one for example here. We have, uh, we have what else? We have for example, do you pay mortgage? And as you can see, it will automatically scroll. Let me try one more time. I'm going to say, do you pay or bitch? And if I click on, if I click on send, as you can see, it will automatically scroll to the last message. Uh, also, one of the most important things is that whenever you type something, we want to wait a little. We don't want the risk. We don't want the the chatbot to respond automatically. Uh, we don't want the chatbot to respond immediately because it would it would uh, look like a uh, it would look a little weird. We want it to to be uh, uh, to look like if we were talking to a human being, and that uh, because a human being, of course, would not um, respond immediately. Uh, a human being would take like a few seconds to uh, respond. To so to add some delay here, you can say. You can here before displaying the message. You can use the uh, set time out. You can set the time, uh, the set time out, and display the message after a specific amount of time. So you can here say set time out, and then here I'm gonna say, for example, two seconds after two seconds. And then what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna copy these two lines. And then I'm going to paste them inside this uh, this uh, set timeout. You can do this also with the with the uh, with this with this function with the chatbot response. But let's test with this function now. Let me refresh. Now, if I say hi and send, the response is going to take a few uh, a couple of seconds. So as you can see, it's not going to be added immediately. It's going to take let me show you this again let me refresh if I say hi and send as you can see it's not it's not gonna be added immediately it's gonna take a couple of seconds if I say do you have a car and send it's gonna take two seconds for the chatbot to respond so as you can see it's gonna to take two seconds which is amazing because we want to make the chatbot uh, the chatbot look like a 
or, so, or sound like a human being, which which now is um, very close to uh, to that, which is amazing. 